Hey folks, thanks for joining me. Um, trying to get out a video for my comics haul because it was insane this week and I I can't afford this. I can't. I can't. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, Wesley Dodds, the Sandman, number one. Okay. Enjoyable. He's like really upset that like his notes may be falling into the wrong hands or weaponized for all the gas gun stuff he was doing. So I thought that was neat. Superboy, Man of Tomorrow. Venom, because Spec, because Natasha, Venom. Sounds great. Teen Titans. I don't like the way that this was, like, kind of advertised on the internet. Like, that, like, the focus of the issue is Garth and his gender fluidity, which like doesn't even come out like that. He just talks about like, he just has a very different culture. Things are very different where he's from. Um, and it's really difficult with when he's hanging out with Donna, when they're like trying to date and like her world is noisy and loud and like, but there's more going on here than that. And I mean, it's Wade's writing. Wade tells it in a really solid way. And we get some action with, uh, I forgot what Guardian calls himself at this point in time, but I think he's calling himself Guardian. He's got the shield and Bumblebee. Um, not Bumblebee. Oh, my God. Oh, wait. Is she Bumblebee? I think she is Bumblebee. Anyhow, I'm derailed. I like the issue. I thought it was handled appropriately as it should be. So I liked it. And I and I also like what there's, a, there's an angle here that they have on Roy that I thought was interesting. Superman lost. I can't wait to dig into this. My precious soups. He's got major PTSD. This series is pretty fantastic. Right. And Batman and Robin number two for Shush. It's so unoriginal, but first appearance, first cover appearance. Again, I just I did it for spec. Moon Knight City of the Dead, because I love Scarlet Scarab and I'm so here for this. So yes. Guardians of the Galaxy. Okay, now say, like, my favorite gaze in space. I'm sorry. So, of course, I grabbed this. And then we've got Danger Street. This is book 10. I don't know what to tell you guys. This is one of those sleeper stories, and Tom King is actually doing a great job. Um... Scorched the uh, Virgin variant because I got the other Virgin variant, so I needed the matching pair. Picked up Epic. I need to catch up on this. I think I only read the first two issues. And Magneto. It'll be interesting to see if they use that character again. Um, amazing Spider-Man. So, okay. So, if I got it straight, this is the end of of the Peter with the Goblin Serum story and the beginning of leading us into Gang War, which I'm, like, not too hyped about, but there looks like there's going to be some interesting Spider-Man stuff in there, so I'm slightly looking forward to it. Superior Spider-Man! Awesome! I actually enjoyed it the first time around. I'm looking forward to what we're doing this time. Spider-Man India number 5, debut of his new outfit and new outfit on the cover, so spec, I grabbed it. Mandalorian number five, first appearance of what's her name, the space witch, whatever. I'm so sorry. Um, but yeah, again, spec grabbed it. Green Lantern number four. I actually enjoy the series, but also first appearance of Sun Estro. So grabbed it. Wolverine featuring Captain America. Okay, this is just gorgeous cover, and like I'm excited about the issue. And then I'm almost done. X Men Red number 16. Again, more Fall of X. And Witch Hammer number one. Which we had Mark Sparacio on our show, the live show Monday. So, gotta support our guest. And I really like Mark. He's great. All right. So, that's it for me. I hope you enjoyed it. What stuff did you pick up? Please leave it in the comments and let me know. Peace out.